Hey everybody, it's Steve here. Welcome back to Metroid. Uh, we are finally going to face some Metroids uh, in this video. Um, and here they are. These are the little buggers that the game is named after. Uh, to defeat them, pretty easy, as long as you got the ice beam, and as long as you don't screw up like I just did there. If one of them should grab you, uh, basically just uh, go into morph ball mode and just bomb the hell out of them. It should pop them off. Like that. Um, but obviously you're going to want to freeze them uh, with the ice beam. Uh, then switch to your missiles, and uh, it takes five missiles to uh, take them out. Uh, if you're skilled or more skilled than I am, uh, you could probably get through this area without even taking a hit. Just every time you see a Metroid, just freeze it. Uh, here's something different, an orange door. Uh, this one takes ten missiles to open up. You know, they're going to make sure that you use uh, all those missile packs that uh, I've been collecting all along. And here come the little annoying Cheerios. Um, the simplest looking enemy of the game, but uh, um, one of the most annoying and most uh, most dangerous. Um, those little Cheerio things are going to cause you the most amount of trouble in this in this level area and uh, in the upcoming area in the fight with my mother brain. Basically, you just kind of take your time in this area. There's no hurry. You know, you don't want to get too many Metroids on, on the screen at, uh, at one time. They yeah, will obviously unfreeze if you wait too long, so try and uh, try and make quick work of them. Nah, I can't get that energy with that. I don't need it, so it's okay. Yeah, the little, little donuts, little Cheerios, whatever you want to call them, but they're annoying. They do pack quite the punch, that's for sure. Uh, now here you're going to have to deal with uh, Metroids and the little Cheerios. They're pretty good about uh, dropping uh, uh, missile refills and, uh, and life refills. I'm probably going to cut this part short um, <coughs> once I reach uh, Mother Brain's area. Just because I don't think there's going to be enough time to get through this area plus Mother Brain, plus what happens afterwards, uh, credits, all that jazz. So, oh, this is kind of annoying. There we go. You know, you can freeze the Cheerios too, but. Oh, no, no. Nah, I'm in trouble here. I got two of them on me. There we go. Oh, jeez. Talk about being backed into a corner. Alright, one more area uh, before uh, we reach, uh, reach Mother Brain. It's a pretty straightforward area here just to keep freezing the Metroids and Taking them out with your with your missiles. Just try to avoid being oh she's caught by them like uh, like I am. Two for one. How about that? Yeah. So these are the creatures that are supposedly the the, the great threat to the universe and what the space pirates want to use uh, as their like ultimate weapon or whatever. Not that much of a threat to be honest. Uh, and there you have it. Um, we are uh, approaching uh, Mother Brain's area. And I'm going to cut the video short, obviously. And uh, we will uh, do that next time. And actually, there's a little bit more. One more? No, that's it. Okay. All right. Um, we'll see you for the uh, final fight against Mother Brain on uh, the next episode of uh, uh, next and final episode of Metroid. See you then. Peace.